Harrison, uh, I mean, you've obviously trained in the Southampton squad. I mean, in terms of where Jay, James is, is, it, is he ready for that level already? Can he play at the top flight if he wanted to, do you think? I mean, I think, I think if you watch the games, and especially in training, he is a very good player. He handles the ball brilliantly. Um, any opponent he's come up against in the championship, he seemed to be able to deal with. Um, and I think, yeah, I think if as long as he can, continues to work, um, he's certainly working towards that, yes. You had a bit of under, uh, under 20 and under 19 involvement, was it, in England? But no, yeah. no under 21, no. no. But what is it like for a young, young player? How, how important is it? Does it matter if you're not involved? Where, where does this sit? Do I know, obviously, for every young player, it's, it's great to be involved in the England setup. And I think he's probably deserved deserving the black. Um, and yeah, it's an honour obviously to go away, um, play for your country, and put on that shirt is an amazing feeling. And I'm very proud of him. In terms of your own development so far this season, how, how is this um, panning out in terms of what you were hoping for when, when you arrived here? Oh uh, yeah, I mean it's it's going well. I feel um, I think the start of the season was a bit up and down. Um, felt like I started the season quite strongly, and then sort of a little bit of dip in form in a couple of the games. Um, and then obviously I had to take a seat on the sideline for a few games when Alex Tetty and Tom Tribal come in and can't take anything away from them. They've done fantastically well and sort of set us up for the position we're in now. Um, so I'm pleased. Um, I'm grateful for the opportunity to come here and play football. That's what I want to do. Um, and I'm hopefully I can push this, help push this club uh, back to where it belongs. Because it was a big change in shape as well then, wasn't it? I mean, that first month you were basically playing and now two people are doing the job that yeah, you were doing yeah, first, yeah. first month. So how's it been playing with, with someone alongside you in that change in shape for the side? Yeah, of course it helps a lot. Um, someone a bit more defensive minded alongside me, a bit more solidarity to the team. And I think that set us up nicely. Um, I think if you watch the games, we've got that defensive structure and we can then build and play from there. And I think if you keep clean sheets in this league with the attacking players that we've got, we'll uh, pick up a lot more points than we won't. Yeah, that last point, has that been the disappointing thing about the last couple of games? Because you, you found yourself trailing and, and regardless of how tired or this, that and the other it is, that, that just makes the task so much harder. Yeah, of course. I mean, like we said, it's the first goal is vital in any game. Um, unfortunately, we haven't been able to get that goal at home. Um, we were unlucky on Tuesday with Marley's header off the post and then they got the other end and not one in the, in the goal. So that's the way it goes. But we're working hard at finishing drills and um, the boys are confident they'll score goals if it gets put on a plate. And they, we've got some players that can produce magic and create, create something out of nothing. So we're confident we, uh, we're going to a game and we can score goals. Is that home, no points from two home games, does that put pressure on your way for? Because not, normally you, know, you want to build your fortress at home and then you can pick up what you get away from home. But yeah, I mean, I don't think we're feeling pressure. Um, you know, like we said, it's I think four away wins in, in the league on the bounce. Um, we seem to pick up a lot of points on the road, so we'll go into Saturday very confident. Um, we know it's going to be an aggressive, uh, tough game. They're in good form, so um, hopefully we'll pick up the three points. How often have you played a sort of right wing back, no. whatever that was on Tuesday? <laughs> no, not too much. <laughs> um, I thought I quite enjoyed it, actually. Um, it was a bit different, but... Um, I mean, I'll do anything for the team and if the manager wants to put me out there and he feels that's the right decision, then that's fine for me. I can work, work as hard as I can and help, hopefully help the team. Yeah, and just lastly, when you're put in that position, I mean, how, how is the, the manager giving you instructions and, and what, what you need to do? But also, how much are you having to wing it? <laughs> yeah, I was winging it. No, um, <laughs> we spoke about it before the game. Um, if we had to change formation, that I was going to go out on the right. Um, so then halfway through the first half, when he changed the formation, I made my way out there. Um, and it's not something I've played before, but I feel like I, I've watched enough football and we speak about tactics and what uh, each position needs to do. So I feel like I can go out there and do a job. It must also emphasise how different it is between doing that and doing a role you know, though, because you, you, the, the concentration you must need when you're doing that compared to when you, you know, not in your comfort zone, but a role you need to know and you can concentrate on other things. Yeah, yeah, um, it was tough. Um, it took me about five, ten minutes to get used to it and sort of the positioning and the runs off of me uh, and who I was getting pressed by and where I was getting pressed from. So it took me five minutes, got half time, spoke to the manager a little bit more about the position and how he wanted me to stay a little bit higher to create space for other people. And then when I got the ball, I was higher up to maybe influence it a bit more. Um, so, but now I got used to it and I quite enjoyed it. In terms of the championship, this has been the first time you played in it. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, what have you made, it, made of it in general? Yeah, very tough. I mean, it's physically demanding. You come up against a lot of different teams. Um, you find a lot of teams uh, are more physical rather than technical and like we are. Um, so it's about adapting to that. And I think we're like, I'm, I'm doing that as I go along um, and I'm really enjoying it. I mean, Wolves have been way down some really good technical players. I mean, the, the better teams in the division, do you feel, because you've obviously been in and around Premier League, do you feel there's not, not much to difference with the better teams in this division? Maybe? Yeah, no, definitely. I feel like there's not a massive gulf. Um, 
And I mean, like coming up against Wolves, obviously they spent millions. Um, they've got very, very good players. So looking at that team, there's not a massive difference between the, their team and the Premier League team, per se. Um, so it's been a very tough uh, start for me. Um, and just getting used to the, the quality of the championship. Do you feel on a personal level now, I mean, they say there's no substitute for going out and playing proper games, maybe not the development side of things, it's not quite as competitive. I mean, do you, do you feel even now, not even halfway through the season, that you've really developed as a player now from when you joined the squad? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I hadn't been out on loan and coming out on loan now, I've realised what it's all about and what I've been missing, um, not playing first team football regularly and I'm loving it. Um, like you said, I'm learning every day, I'm learning off different coaches, different players, experienced players, um, and I'm really enjoying it, yeah. And, and just one more, what's the one thing you want from the rest of the season now? Because presumably you are here definitely all season, or is there anything in January where you might get caught? No, I'm here all season, yeah. Yeah, so what's, what's the one thing you want? I uh, just want to build consistency and pick up points as much as possible and stay around those playoff places um, and make, really make a push after Christmas.